Leo, song that's playing for you is talking to the moon. Hey, yo, look, so you might be in your feelings or somebody might be in their feelings because you know the, you know all their secrets. Leo, it's like, and you know all their secrets and you ain't stressing about the shit no more. It's like you're not letting someone else's problems burden you no more because you know this shit wasn't stable to begin with. Matt, someone may be in a position where they don't want you to go, but you already changed your mind about, it's like you already changed the mind you made up about this situation or relationship. Now you're seeing it differently and that you seeing it differently is bringing a shift to how you invest or how you work on that, how you participate with them there or him or her or how you just express yourself in that community or environment. And it's supposed to be this way. This was, you had to become aware of this to make this change. And whether you're talking to your own moon, you becoming more aware of your feelings regarding a situation you did not want to be emotionally aware of, but you wanting to not be emotionally aware or eventually you can only bottle it up for so long before that shit motherfucker pop on you. You feel me? Now something made something in your experience, your day to day life made that bottle pop. It's like something popped the cork for you and now you're being overwhelmed with the knowing you have about a relationship friendship or a situation or that's somebody outside of you somebody outside of you is overwhelmed with the emotions they have about you now that they ain't dealing with you no more you feel me now that they can't deal with you no more see someone might have not have brought their best mind or their best they, they ain't bring their best communication to a situation or a space with you and now look they only bump their own head now they can't fuck with you no more and now you you in a position where you just now you got you got a better sense of self. It's like they ain't do shit but help you level up, help you gain more awareness and better invest and know how to better communicate your emotions to your world. So now you in that position, or is that somebody outside of you who in a position they communicate in their feelings away from you? They ain't like they ain't get shit but learn how to better emotionally express themselves from you, Leo. And now that has you in a certain type of mind because you're not in the same light. You used to be in that situation. Now, the person you may be or the person I'm talking about or the people or the environment I'm talking about may have received you in a higher perspective previously. Now, they don't think of you so highly no more if it's that type of vibe. Look who put up in this. Y'all look at that one for all Look on my deposit. So yeah, Cash Day Freestyle is a song that's playing for you. Somebody getting paid. Whether that's just paying mine, you somebody ain't paying you no mind no more, or is somebody actually getting some cheese? You know what side of the fence you Yeah, somebody was lying. Man, I gotta go a little hard. Man, don't give yourself like talk. Yeah, somebody, you not, you not bringing a shit. If you lying, Leo, you the one who lying, and you lying got you caught up in some shit. And it's like you, you can't do shit but start a new lie type shit. You feel me? It's almost like you so deep in it. it the only way you could stop is by going deeper in it. You know what that means? If it ain't a situation, hey, look, you so deep in it. The only way you can stop is just by keep going. That or you just ain't saying shit. You may be in a situation and you in a toxic environment or you in a toxic relationship with these folk, this person. And you may just, if you're in a relationship, it's like you ain't talking to your partner no more. You closed off an aspect of you. You're new. Anything new you got, any new ideas, you're going to keep it the same. Whatever the same is with this person, with these people. You ain't going to bring shit new there because you know what type of space that is. You know that shit toxic. You know that motherfucker, that, that environment ain't it for you. So you ain't gonna bring shit there. Whatever that means. Yeah, motherfuckers is burning. That shit weigh heavy on you. Anytime you bring an idea here, anytime you try to spark something new, anytime you communicate your truth or you show who you are there, Ed, there ain't having it. So you're not gonna bring it no more. If it's that type of vibe. But it look up. Like I can tell you, I got these little niggas shook up. I'm so what's smoking on dope with my foot up. If it ain't a situation where you lying got you stuck and you was stuck in some shit, let me tell you. But all look, all that's being stuck brought you emotional clarity. The first song I was playing was talking to the moon. It brought you you all this brought you to the point of realization about who you are or what you feel about. And that type of vibe. Yeah, you got the emotional clarity about who, what, where, what you want to do with your time, how you want to express yourself there. Look, you know what is it for you, so to speak. But you still in a whole lot of she hot. 
up before you can work on what you actually want to work on. Look, you got a codependent motherfucker on your hip. If you're dealing with folk, man, or you're dealing with a person, yeah, you're dealing with a real toxic motherfucker who ain't going to let you go as easy as you want them to let you go. And that might be burdensome on you, Leo. It's like you, you could be in a position where you may want your partner to find you or find you unattractive, not in a physical sense, but in just like you want them to move away from you. So you could be in a position where you communicate in a certain type of energy to try to do that. You feel me? You trying to get this person off you. Get these people off you. It ain't working. It ain't working. No matter what you do type of vibe. You feel me? If they, this motherfucker right on you. This ain't an aggro gimmick. That's all of us said in a minute. Yeah. Shit, I'm telling you. Hey, motherfuckers outside of you coming up with new ideas. It's like, even though you not... Doing nothing new, your partner out still outside you trying to start something new with this, trying to get a new spark going, trying to, you feel me? If it's that type of, it's like they won't give up. Could you be loved as it's on a plan for you? If it ain't a situation where you don't want to do, it's, it's like you want to do something new, but you still living a lie or you're not going to tell the truth type shit. You feel me? It's almost like you're going to get another job without telling that job you got another job type shit, but you're going to try to make it work. Type, if it's that type of vibe, you put your foot, Leo, you know what the fuck I'm talking about. You know what the fuck I'm talking about, Leo. It, 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 it could definitely be, slug. it could be sneaky link energy. And put your foot, Leo. If it's that type of vibe, then it's that type of vibe. If it ain't a situation outside of you where if you got someone moving away from you, then you're obsessed with that person or those people or you no longer being able to communicate anything new there. You can't start a new there because there is gone, so to speak, wherever there is. And that only is making you obsessed because you want to be there. Or it's a situation where you, it's like you giving shit, almost trying to make make yourself seem as unattractive as possible to this environment so that this environment no longer wants to be new with you. But it ain't working. Hey, look, I'm telling you, that motherfucker's still on your hair. You know what I'm talking about, Leo. If you know that's the type of vibe we in, Leo, that's the type of conversation we having, and that's the type of conversation we having. You may look, in, in your inside voice made a decision. That's why you stopped. That's why you're not doing that no more. You're not handling it like that no more. You're doing it like this now. Why? Oh, because you you, you had some, and you look, you, you got an inner, new inner sense of peace. You got a new inner sense of what love is in that in your outside world don't match that. That's luck. That's why you ain't doing shit new there. You know the truth already. Look, and that has you holding back you. You not communicating the you. You know you can communicate here because here can't house that energy properly, so to speak. This space has no oxygen for that energy from you. And you know you could be loved. And that's just on its plan for you. But you got something on your hip. Yeah, that shit came out. Yeah, you got something on your hip. You got something or someone on your hip. Ain't letting you go without a fight there, Leo. Look, you the light in their life. You don't own, you, mm, you know what that means for you, Leo. It's a burden. Motherfuckers, it's burden. Because of this, though. I'll let you know that much. If it ain't you, and it's someone outside, it, you, it's hard. Look, you know, though, you, you, you got a whole, you know a lot, Leo, about this. You know a whole lot. You got a whole, a whole understanding about a situation, a relationship, a friendship. You know what you need to know and you know what you need to know has you in the space to know you can't go here. You can't do, you can't be you, the best you you can be in this environment, in this atmosphere. You know that. You may not be in it yet, but you know that. Yeah, look, that's why you're emotion you already emotionally separated from this. Cause that shit was making you look, that shit was on yeah, that's whatever that was, yeah, that shit was draining you. 
and put your foot. Bubbly is the song that's playing. Somebody anxious around you, Leo, if it ain't you. I told you the cork pop. Some of you probably get your bottle probably getting shaken up and you getting ready to bust because you tired of being in a life that ain't the one you want to live. And it, it's the fact that you know this is far from what you want to live. And that's what's even pushing you a tad bit further. I still got a cup more for you though. And I'm seeing on your way. You know what I'm talking about. Yeah, look, you just hurt people, hurt people. You got some, look, you investing, you showing this, you still participating in whatever you tied, to, you feel like you tied to is only, is what's hurting you. The three to three, but you got that, you got that one truth you're not bringing here. You got that one knowing, that one understanding, that one safe space for you, whether that's just a mindset you go back to, yeah, you participate in an environment and you shake hands with people you don't really give a fuck about on a daily, damn near 24-7. It's 24-6, it's not quite the seven. You still got that one, one hour to yourself. The one hour to fall back into what you actually love. And you doing that is just making you realize what you don't love. And put your foot, if it ain't a situation where you you starting doing something new. And that's breaking someone's heart outside of you. Because you holding yourself back from something so or someone. You not communicating the same no more. Put your foot in the shoe that fits you though. Why did you see my kind of a scene? 